Hello, everybody. Good evening. We are back at Disney Springs to see Chelsea and Kristen and Chelsea's mom. Kristen's leaving tomorrow. Right, tomorrow? Yeah, her mom. Her mom's leaving tomorrow. Chelsea's not, don't worry. But we're back at Disney Springs. lights are always here. Okay. These lights are always here. So we just had Homecoming when it opened up for like, so what, six months? I think for six months it was called a home, Homecoming Coming. with a G, but Which now it's... when we ate it in February. We'll put the video right there. Yeah. Um, that is my, I think I declared today at dinner, that's my favorite restaurant, period. Like, that's just my favorite Disney it's Better than Ohana for her. Yeah, like everything I had, I was like, that's my favorite thing. That's my favorite thing. Fried green tomatoes. So we had fried green tomatoes with like, what was the meat on it? I think it was ham. Some kind of ham. So we, we split the biscuits, these like butter cheese biscuits with fried fried chicken and hot, hot, hot honey with pickles on it. So good. That's what I got last time. I got the same exact thing this time. So good. And then we had some hush puppies as well. And good and drinks, good food. We had Chelsea, Kristen, and Chelsea's mom with us. Chelsea's mom's going home tomorrow, so that's why we came out here. Unexpected, we ate dinner. We ate dinner, and then we didn't realize, like, we weren't gonna get food there, but then we're like, you know what, we're here. Like I said, we get to Disney property, our nose opens up, and our stomachs open up well, too. Well, then we have leftovers. So. Yeah, we do have leftovers. Oh my God, look at this beautiful display for Coco. So you may guess from this right here, this display, but we are in the movie theaters. I don't know if you knew this about Sarah and I, but back in high school, before we had jobs, responsibilities, and bills, and everything, we went to the movies yeah. all the time in Chicago. <laughs> that was our thing. And now we're gonna start going again because our friend Tyler. Wait, disclaimer: not sponsored, not paid endorsement. <laughs> Wish that'd be cool, but um, it's a good deal, so it doesn't matter. But Tyler, our friend who just moved here, you saw, and who stayed with us last week, told us this, about this thing called Movie Pass. So this looks like a little red Mastercard that says Movie Pass on it. And it's a super good deal. It's 10 bucks a month, and you get to go to, it, they say it's unlimited movies, but the fine print is one 2D movie a day. So you can't do IMAX, can't do 3D, but any 2D screen once a day for a whole yeah. forever, or for a month. So even, like right now, these these tickets were eleven nineteen each, and it's $10 a month. So with one movie, we are already saving money. Now we might, like now, might not have gone to a movie every single month, but that's because in Chicago, us two to go to the movies was like thirty dollars. Minimum, minimum. Right. Sometimes forty if it was a special three D or yeah. Special and we screen. just bought Star Wars tickets for forty dollars. Right, which we did because we want to make sure we see the opening day. Um, and in three D. Yes, and in three D. But sometimes we would go right after school, right after work, and we'd have to get food because we'd not eat or anything like that. So then yeah. that thirty dollar trip turns into a fifty dollar trip. Or sometimes we'd see multiple movies in the same day. So. And now we're super close, we live super close to Disney Springs, so we and can- And they count, like it is select theaters, but the Disney Springs AMC counts. So. It's like 95% of theaters in the country. I'm pretty sure any AMC, just look into it. If it's it, Apparently it's been around for like five or seven years. Tyler's had it for like three <laughs> years, and it's like a great deal. So we're gonna go to the movies a lot, and today we're gonna go see- American Made. American Made Which Tom we Cruise. just watched the trailer outside. <laughs> but we love going to movies, so. But now it's like we could do this all the time. Yeah. So if you have any movies that like we don't talk about or maybe out of our realm that are still in theaters, let us know. And, maybe and we'll, we'll do some like cool we'll reviews go check it or out. something. Yeah. We're definitely going to go see this. Can't wait. Or like check out different theaters in the area too. And to be honest, I'd pay $10 a month just to walk in here, see the trailers for the theater, yeah, for a movie, like, and then walk out and not even see the movie because I love trailers. Yeah, on our Apple TV we have a trailers app and we literally just watch trailers and most of the time we don't even see the movies. Yeah. So that's what we that's are. what we've going on. And yes, it's late on a Monday night when I work tomorrow, but it's not that long of a movie. It's not that long of a movie, and it's it's like we go home and watch a movie on the couch, or we watch a new movie in these comfy seats. So 
Let's go. I sincerely apologize for my constant greasy forehead <laughs> at the end of the day. But we just got home from watching that American Made movie and it was pretty good. Yeah, it was, it was shot really cool. Yeah, I think that was just like enticing for us as like the storyline. It was like, like a based on true story, dramatic history kind of thing going on. Um, you knew that it wasn't going to end with a happy ending, so yeah. it was like... It was, it, was, cool. it, was, it was shot really well, it made it look like it was supposed to be in the 80s and everything, so that was kind of cool. Yeah. Um, but we're home now, mm -hmm. and we gotta get the pup ready for bed and everything. Yes. It's good to be home. It's good to be home. We know what our goals are, we know what we hope to accomplish, and believe me, it's the most exciting and challenging assignment we've ever tackled at Walt Disney Productions. <laughs>